Hey everyone, it's the host with the most here. It is Team Mara. How's everyone doing out there? And this Monday's edition, I am doing pretty well. Ladies and gentlemen, I have a social media account, but don't worry, I'll discuss that later on in the video. So sit back, relax, put your feet up, grab some meat, or grab something to drink, or maybe, just maybe, you want to chill like a villain and hear my thoughts, my opinions on the subject. And of course, the link will be down below or the article will be down below. Now, this video will be strictly an article. Let's get the show on the road. Now, everyone knows that Morgan is out due to an injury. So, on the May 29th episode of Raw, they will have a new champion crown again. Okay? It happens. These wrestlers get hurt a lot. So, new champion. And we all know that who's going to win it. Baszler and Ronda Rousey. It's no-brainer. Okay, now about the injury, it looked like she had a this kind of injury, so and and she might have surgery. So that sucks. That means she's gonna be out for a very very long time, and then whenever she gets back in a square circle, the question is, will she be back in the tag team title picture or in a different pitcher who knows you know maybe she'll go back to the women's title pitcher or nothing or maybe they should just keep in the tag team women's division for a while i don't know what w has plans for her once she returns so all that other stuff you know the fatal four-way is a fatal four-way yeah, Fatal 4-Way, they should just have an elimination match. It goes a lot faster, a lot quicker, a lot more interesting instead of one pinfall, but that's WWE for you. Now, I know a lot of you are bummed out because uh, Raquel had to drop the belts. And then they got to have a Fatal 4-Way match. And whoever wins that will become the new champion on Raw Edition. Now, I guarantee... This is just my quick prediction. Baszler and Ron Rousey will not, will not have that belts that long. They won't because they're never on TV. So, I think Ron Rousey is a part timer. I think I'm not too sure, but I don't like the like gook on their eyes. It looks horrible, but whatever. They don't need that kind of stuff. I know it's the part of their gimmick right now, but it looks horrible for me. You might have a different opinion, but in my opinion, again, this women's division for tag teams are very, very weak for Raw, for women's, and and for SmackDown. Very weak. Probably a lot of you will not agree with me, but whatever. And another thing is, for the bonus round, they should come up with another title for women's. I know they have the main title for Raw and SmackDown. They have the tag team belts. It doesn't really mean anything, in my opinion. And another thing is, come up with a mid-card belt like they do for the men's. Can they do that? Is it possible? Or probably don't have an, enough women to go around to do that kind of thing. Well, if they do, should it be exclusive for Raw or exclusive to SmackDown? Or should it just be on both shows? I don't know. Mind boggling, you know? Probably it's never gonna happen. No one thought we'll ever have a women's tag team title, and it, it did. It did happen. Anyway, have a good one. Now, follow me on Instagram, Twitch, Twitter, TikTok, all my social media accounts will be down below. If you wanna be part of the Robert Show, that's fine. And then, if not, don't worry about it. Peace out and stay safe out there.